Let's wait for everybody to get on. I know it's the Lord's Day. Wait for everybody to get on. I know uh, everybody's probably just now getting out of church or maybe not getting out of church. Give us a little bit of time. Mm, got something to drink back here. Ooh. We got some people on. All right, y'all saw the title. It is wing wang time, all right? It is wing wang time. <laughs> we've, got the, we've got the tarp out. I got a tarp, it was 12 bucks. This is one hack you guys can do. If you guys are painting cars at home, you're painting cars outside, let's say you don't got a garage, you don't got shh. I can't cuss on YouTube. You don't got nothing, okay? The bare minimum you guys can do to get a slightly cleaner paint job is get you a tarp that you can lay out so you have a barrier between the dirt and your paint job. Okay, just a little, little quick hack. So, got it all sanded out. We're in the process of taping it. Um, I had a tow truck driver drop off a car, so I was talking with him for a while, but we're, we're, uh, we're letting the panels heat up, okay, because you know paint works well with heat. All right, especially with how much paint we're gonna be putting on this thing. This, this wing wang sprayer puts out a lot of paint. So, um, yeah, I just wanna show you guys that. Um, definitely thought this was the, the edited video, but still psyched for this too much. Yeah, man, I'm psyched too. I hope you guys are pumped. I literally got back to the shop and I was like jumping up and down, like, yeah, it's freaking wing wang time. We're gonna spray the car, hell yeah. <laughs> um, but I just wanted to open it up, guys. Um, you know, I've been trying to do live videos like uh, once a week just to answer you guys' questions because I know that throughout the week, you know, things get a little hectic for me. God, I, have, I have days, and I mean days, into getting this thing prepped. Just days of straight body work and sanding and priming. And it, it's, been a, it's been a lot of work, guys. It, it has been a lot of work just to get us to this point right here. Um, so during the week I get real busy. So I, I try and, trying to do a, a live video here and there um, just to answer y'all's questions. So bring them on. What do y'all want to ask me? Well, y'all y'all want to ask me what, what I worked out this morning at the gym? <laughs> what am I, uh, what kind of color? Who wants to guess the color? Who, who wants to guess the color of the car? Come on, who wants to guess the color? What do y'all think? Y'all thinking Nardo gray? Y'all thinking blue, purple, chameleon? What do y'all think I'm gonna do? All right, I'll see the chat here. Top of the chat. Just ordered the single stage gloss black yesterday because of your videos. Yeah, man, um, the single stage black from Speedico. Dude, guys, I've been using that product for like three or four years now. <laughs> It is bomb. Um, the only thing that sucks, obviously, you can't ex escape this problem. Is single stage. You do have to buff it once a year. Um, if you're if you're keeping it inside of a garage, you might be able to skate away with that problem. But uh, it is it is still extremely good paint. I've gotten show quality show quality results right off the gun with the single stage gloss black that Speedo Coat sells. Some of the other brands, not so much. Um, all right, so we got some people saying gloss black, Nardo gray would look good. I mean, come on, guys. I haven't done like a you know, buck wild paint job in a long time. Come on, I want to do something spicy. I'm not doing Nardo gray, and I'm not doing black. I want to do something spicy. I haven't done something spicy for you guys in a while. It's been actually a long time. Like, I, I really was doing a lot of my more spicy paint jobs, like my chameleon, my super custom chameleon paints and stuff like that. Uh, back in back in um, my other shop, my little three car garage I had back in uh, can't say location, but yeah. <laughs> so um, I want to do something spicy on this one. So it's going to be spicy. Somebody somebody gets a spicy color, like maybe like lime green or like 
orange with flake in it. I don't know, something. Let's see what everybody's commenting. Let me see here. Use nascent base with SMR 1150 uh, clear coat. Yep. Yeah, that, that's really, really good uh, clear coat. I actually have a lot of videos coming up with the SMR 1150. I got one I literally already have fully edited. I hope you guys, by the way, I hope you guys want to see more inflatable booth content. I have um, two videos that I shot last week. One is fully edited, one I have still have to edit um, with the inflatable spray booth. And um, both are with the SMR 1150 clear coat. Because like I said, guys, I know the economy is getting rough. Everybody's trying to find some cheaper alternatives to you know, get their projects done. So I wanted to do some more videos with some of our cheaper products to appease you guys. All right, so we got some guesses coming in. Nissan GTR, Daytona Blue. No, not that one. Metallic Blue with Metallic Flake. No. Orange with a Gold Pearl. Really good guess, and that is very spicy, but no. Um... Shoot, yeah, I'll be looking forward to them. Yeah, ma'am. Um, Bear Budget Garage, are you painting it grabber green? Ooh, bro, you're getting close. You're getting close. <laughs> it, it, yeah, you're getting close, bro. I'll, I'll just say that, you're getting close. Um, you're definitely getting close. Bright orange, black cherry pearl. Black cherry pearl would be cool. I actually almost did a murdered out candy job for a, a, a guy a while ago, um, but he was cheap and thought my price was too expensive, so I told him to go pay $12,000 or $10,000 elsewhere. <laughs> yeah, a little spit on the ground won't hurt. Keep, keep a little less dust in the paint. But yeah, guys, um, so as far as prep on this thing, uh, it did not come out too bad. I Okay, all right, I know you guys are going to call me hack. We got a little bit of nitro stain on the hood. Um, there's a bunch of chips and stuff like that on the hood. I did not feel like sanding it, priming it today. I wanted to just get this freaking thing painted. So I filled it with a little bit of little bit of nitro stain. Got a little bit of nitro stain up here. Okay. Put a little nitro stain in a couple small spots. Not that's really gonna make a huge difference, but I figure what the hell. Um, nitro stain is not bad. The only thing it's bad about it is it does shrink. So don't put anything you really care about. If you really care about something, just get body filler. But, all right, let me see the comments. Worm, hi, hello Worm, how are you doing today? Thank you for joining the chat. Uh, Wayne Speed Shop, the mobile refinish fast clear is awesome, 30 minute dry time is amazing, buffs out well. Yeah, um, dude, uh, Speedoco, just so you guys know, Speedoco actually started their company it was only for mobile auto body. They sold mobile auto body specific products. And um, it actually wasn't until the launch of Speedo Coat Refinish Network, which was me, uh, that they really started branching out their products. And I, of course, worked with the president of the company. I worked with one of their top sales reps. And I said, hey, why don't we get this? Hey, why don't we get that? Hey, why don't we get custom colors? Why don't we enhance our detail product line? You guys saw the, um, the Speedico wheel cleaner, now in a full gallon. I requested that it, be, it come in a full gallon. So through the influence of my YouTube page and me doing the custom paint jobs and stuff like that, um, Speedico branched out and started doing more products. So now we sell mobile auto body products, but we also sell restoration style, you know, custom paint products. By the way, speak of the devil, not really speak of the devil, I'm just saying that. Um, guys, I've been getting a lot of questions. If you want custom paint, if you want a specific color, contact Speedo Coat. You have to have a paint code. Okay, you have to have a paint code. And if you shoot them a paint code, they can make any, just about any color in the world. Okay, just about any color. So shoot them a, shoot them a message. You can get any color you want made. Lime green with gold pearl. Oh, bro, you... You guys are, all right, you guys are getting close. It's, it is some type of a green, but y'all have to see the video. Did not know that. Yeah, bro, um, yeah, like I said, wait, uh, Speedoco started back in, um, was it 2002 or 2008? It wasn't, it wasn't, wasn't long. Um, no, it wasn't that long ago. Speedoco's only been around for about, I think like 15 years now. 
or yeah, something like that. So yeah, um, but like I said, I've been using their products since I've been like 19 years old. So I've been using their products almost since the company came out, um, which is why they decided to sponsor me um, because I, you know, they, they know I've been one of their longest customers and I know their products like the back of my hand. So yeah, um, really just to give you guys a little backdrop on Speedocoat, where we started and where we are now, um, which of course now we are an unstoppable force. We offer everything start to finish, including the base coat, the color, uh, we, there is nothing we don't have, literally nothing. Can you use the Glamour clear coat on full body paint jobs? Absolutely. You guys know during the winter time, I grabbed the fast activator with the uh, spot panel clear and I, that's how I paint cars in the winter time. I'll use a spot clear, which is designed to dry like that in the summertime. And I'll actually use it on a full body paint job in the winter time and it helps me to get over that crutch of the winter. You know, a lot of a lot of the uh, the bimbo am the amateurs out there. Oh, you can't paint cars in the cold. No, you just don't know what the hell you're doing. Uh, you have to, you know, manipulate. Do a little manipulation here. You have to manipulate the products to make them work for you. Okay, that's how you. That's how things work um, in this in this trade. If you're a bimbo and you, you, you're stuck in one particular way on how to do things, okay, well, you, you're just not, you're not gonna get anything done. Um, just like you guys see, you know, I'm a freaking professional painter, and here I am about to grab this Wing Wang freaking 20 hour sprayer from Harbor Freight and try and paint a car with it, all right? I'm just going out of the box. You have to, you have to be willing to go out of the box and do things like that to become a better painter. Um, so yeah, uh, Wayne Speedshaw, thanks for the content, no problem, man. Worm, yeah, wow, I didn't know that. Yeah, not a lot of people know the history of Speedacoat. I've been, I've been one of their longest standing customers. Um, so, you know, I pretty much, you know, know just about everything. So, I uh, found t online two years ago. Ever since then, I've used it. Okay, Synergy Green, that's a good guess. You guys are getting real close. Hit that like button, guys. <laughs> Thanks, wasn't bad, SN95. How is the bed liner? Uh, Patrick Young, I've used the bed liner a handful of times. I've used their colored bed liner. Um, it is actually really sick. Uh, it has a little bit of flex additive in it, so it stays a, a little bit kind of like a little bit soft. So it's good for adhesion. Um, I have no complaints with it. I've honestly used it a bunch of times. It's great. Have their golf con. I have a two-stage turbine system. Any experience with that? Um, I'm gonna be honest with you, man. You guys are about to find out today, and I mean, fingers crossed this goes well for me. You guys are about to find out today. You guys can grab literally anything to paint a car. If you can, like I said, if you can, you know, finesse and, and, and you know, finick around a little bit, and you can finesse the material to work for you, okay, and you can spray out of anything. All right, within reason. I mean, obviously, you know, if you want the best finish, grab one of my spray guns, get a decent style compressor, and you know, you'll be laying down some shit quality finishes, in theory. So, you know, but any, anything will work, guys. Anything will work. Um, wow, you guys are, we are getting a lot of comments here. After spraying a car and polishing it three months, after, after three months, it starts to turn white. Can I wet sand it with 800 and re-clear it? Yes, you can. You can wet sand it with 800, shoot more clear coat over it, and uh, you should be good to go. Base coat activator, been adding it in some of my paint just to try it out. How often do you use it and when? Um, base coat activator, I mainly use it uh, with um, some single, a lot of single stages, because I, I, I just, I want them to be durable. Single stages are known to be less durable. I add them to single stages. And I also add them to like top tier, um, you know, paint jobs that I'm doing, you know, paint jobs that I, like, I really want to last. You know what I mean? Like this is like a, like this dude is paying the top of the top, the tippity top money to get his stuff done. I'll throw a little base coat activator in there because it is expensive. Now you can add base coat activator to any paint job. I mean, if you guys want, I'll add it to my paint job today. I didn't think about it. I got it sitting on the shelf. I'll add it today. Matter of fact, I probably should because I didn't do like the best job prepping this thing, so I think I'm gonna use the tools I got. And <laughs> but no, I mean I did a decent job. I mean everything's scuffed, but it's me, me, you know. So 
why a little base coat activator today just to you know, mess around. But yeah, you can add base coat activator to any paint job and it will increase the durability, the longevity of the base coat, um, et cetera, et cetera. All right, let's see what other comments we got coming in. Can I order product from you? Possibly. To, no, guys, I, look, I, and a lot of people have asked me this. I don't actually work for Speedacoat, okay? I am a independent guy. All I do is to make videos for Speedacoat, okay? I mean, of course, you guys know, I'm kind of like the face of the company. You know, when somebody talks about Speedacoat, it's, hey, it's Marco from Speedacoat Finish Network, blah, blah, got it. But I don't actually physically work for the company. Um, of course, you know, I have a sponsor, I have a uh, supplemental sponsorship with Speedacoat um, because I'm one of their longest standing products and because I'm probably one that is the most educated on their products. Um, I've used almost literally every single one of their products at least twice. Um, but I don't actually physically work for Speedacoat. However, if you guys are looking for somebody to order from, um, one of their top sales reps, Brad, who may, many of you guys probably have heard that name and have ordered from Brad. Brad is an expert, okay? As good as you guys think I am, as good as you guys think that I'm the Harry Potter of auto, auto body and paint, he's like the Harry Potter on steroids, all right? <laughs> really great guy, extremely knowledgeable, and uh, knows a lot about chemistry. Um, very, very good guy. Um, so if you guys are looking for a sales rep to order from, order from Brad. He will help you out with everything you need. Um, so yeah, but just want to clear that up, clear that up in the air. Um, have you ever clear coated a single stage metallic? You can, but you have to wet, you have to wet sand single stage guys. Like if you want to clear coat single stage, you got to wet sand, you got to let it dry and then you got to wet sand it and then you can put your clear coat on top. EMI, love the vids. Thanks for you. I found you out by speed of coat, solid stuff and affordable. Yeah, man. Um, even with inflation and all this political BS going on, um, we are still the cheapest and best brand on the market, hands down, and that's never going to change, just to be honest. Dono DeBarber, what's up, Mark? Hey, man, thanks for joining the feed. Thanks for joining the chat. Um, I have a single stage, 650 watt airless sprayer. I was wondering any wide angles, but all the purpose tinter destroyed it huh i haven't i tell me what brand it is because i've never i've never heard of that one they need a guy like you their products are good i never knew about them where can i find them brad hey if you if you call the main number um for speedo coat uh he she's usually the one to pick up if not uh if you if it's somebody else picks up just ask for brad and they should be able to forward you over to them so, but um, no guys, let me be honest with you, like I, I could work for Speedacoat. Uh, if I wanted a job with Speedacoat tomorrow, I would have a job. Um, I, and I probably would be, you know, Brad, Brad has been in there a while, but I would be up there with Brad as far as sales reps goes. I would, I would blow everyone else out the water if I wanted to. But, um, you know guys, I have a 9,000 square foot shop I have to attend to. Um, I have uh, other part-time, I'm a part-time real estate investor. I have other real estate in, uh, investments that I'm working on. Um, I have a business to run. I have three businesses. To be honest, I have the YouTube. I have my spray gun brand. These you guys have buy them. Thank you for buying. I hope you guys are enjoying them. Um, best spray guns out there for the money. And then I have my auto body business. I have my body shop business, which is an auto body business, and I have my mobile auto body business. I have way too much stuff going on to even consider taking on, you know, a, you know, a part time job or full time job with Speedo Code. I would love to, and I might when I when I semi retire, I might, you know, step up in the company and uh, you know and, and be one of their sales reps or you know maybe. Uh, vice president or something of, of uh, product development, you know, because you guys know I love developing new stuff. I like, you know what I mean? That's, I want to offer everything we can to you guys. So, but, um, but yeah, no, I'm, ju I'm literally just here to represent the product, to show you guys how to use it, how to finesse the product, 
you know, and, and to teach you guys to be experts in, in going outside of the box and getting the best finish possible. Okay, I'm not one of the, the bimbos at the body shop. Well, you got to do it this way because this is, this is the right way to do it. I've been doing it like this for, oh, 30-something years. Well, you've been doing it wrong for 30 years, dude, okay? Like, just to be honest, you don't know. Like, there's a million other ways you can do this and get a good finish. Sorry. <laughs> so, I, I, gosh, I cannot stand those guys. I, those guys are called the auto body police. They're like the guys between, like, you know, the age of 40 and, like, 60. Oh, I've been doing this for freaking 30, 30, 40 years, and you're doing it wrong. Blah, blah, blah. Shut up, dude. Just shut up. I've got, I've getting, I've gotten better paint jobs than you in my backyard with freaking some cheap cheapo base coat off the internet and some speedo coat clear like there's a million ways you can do this trade guys it's, and that's all that's all i'm trying to show you okay i'm a professional painter i will consider myself an expert but i'm also the expert that will say hey uh do what you can with what you got i'm not gonna tell you it's the wrong way i'm just gonna tell you hey if, it, if you get a decent finish who cares who who honest who honestly cares if it looks good to you and it looks good standing five feet away, and everybody else says it looks good. Who cares? You know what I mean? Do know the barber. I recently been spraying dip pearls with my car projects, adding in clear coat. Never got a glossy finish when done. Uh, pearls, I usually recommend as far as pearls go, just buy something that's pre formulated because there's scientists behind this whole paint game. And when you go and you try to, you know, make something at home if you don't really know what you're doing you're not you're not going to get a good you're not going to get a good result you know what i mean so i usually recommend buying something pre-formulated uh that 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 will that will work for you you know there's there's already people out there that have tested this stuff you know a million times they've done a, you know a 10 20 30 paint jobs with something they pre-formulated and and it, and it works so uh, Dr. Meter paint sprayer, 650 watt. Okay, electric paint. Oh, okay, amazing sprayer, but can't handle all the all-purpose thinners. Hmm, weird. That's weird. Maybe if it's too thin, it doesn't work. Uh, I don't know. Some of the some of the, some of the paint sprayers are only made to run thick paints. So you know, like I said, guys, when we're doing this kind of stuff, I'm really just doing this just for you guys. <laughs> if I didn't have a YouTube page and I didn't have like a bunch of people follow me. Would I do something like this? No. I just wanted, but I did want to challenge myself. I want to say, hey, can I paint a car with a freaking little cheap wing wang China paint sprayer and, and get a good finish? Maybe. I don't know. But you got to understand, if you, if you guys are going to go outside the box, you, you have to be ready for the outside of the box results. Sometimes it doesn't work. And when you, work, when you go outside the box and you're doing something that nobody else has ever done, you're not going to be able to get help. No one is going to come save you, okay? If it turns out like, like crap, nobody's going to come help you. Nobody's going to come save you, all right? You are on your own. <laughs> yeah. So, Speedo Pearls. Uh, yeah, Speedo Coat does sell pearls. You guys have seen some custom paint jobs I've done with Speedo Coat Pearls. Um, they do sell pearls on the website. And the thing is, their pearls last forever. You can use like a teaspoon of pearls in like their, uh, their, their clear mixing base, spray that on there, and then spray your clear coat on top of it. And it actually looks pretty cool. I've done some really cool custom paint jobs with their pearls. Uh, Scott Huber, just here, to, just here to say, really enjoy your channel. I learned a lot. I have an old 2001 Accord that I'm going to get brave enough to refinish one day. Thank you. Hey, man. Get the hell out there and get it done. Uh, we only got about another four to six weeks of warm weather. Go on down to Harbor Freight, get you a bare sander, get you some 320, some 180, some 600, some 400. Sand that sucker out. Uh, get you some Speedico body filler. You know, even if you do the body work half, half ass or whatever, it really don't matter, guys. As long as you get looking good from five feet away, those of you guys at home, don't, don't, don't be a, in my opinion, man, don't be a perfectionist, all right? I like to sleep at night, get it looking decent, paint the sucker, send it down the road, man. You guys know that's what I do with 90% of my jobs. So, no, it works amazing, but I got I got owned be, up uh, because of the 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 tint the tinter. Hmm. Okay, weird. Uh, yeah, I don't 
I don't know, man. This is gonna be my first time using a electric sprayer to paint a car, so I'm I'm kind of new to this one. But um, all right. So I got 25 of yous on here. Okay. So flash sale. Okay, flash sale. The MV ones. I have done less in sales on the MV1, so I'm gonna push you guys to, to, to buy one. All right, 24 hours only. Email me at cash2kcars at gmail.com. Cash is a money, cash, the number two, the letter K, cars at gmail.com, okay? You guys can get the MV1 shipped to your door with a rebuild kit, 1.3, and a 1.4 tip rebuild kit. You guys can get it shipped to your door for 199. 199. I, I I promise you, I will never be offering that price again. 199 shipped to your door. Okay, flash sale, 24 hours. You got to email me within 24 hours of me this video ending. So y'all have till like two, one o'clock or two o'clock in the mor uh, afternoon tomorrow to email me your order. Okay, it's cash app only, so you gotta cash app me the money. Um, order ship out within five to 10 business days. I have a lot going on uh, in my life. You guys know I run multiple businesses. So I like to tell everybody, uh, give everybody a little bit of a buffer, five to 10 business days and the spray guns will ship out. The MV1 guys. So this is my more uh, fancier, it's just a spray gun only. All this is a spray gun, air regulators, and this one comes with the rebuild kit. Um, spray gun only, that's all it is. So $199. You guys are basically getting my, my MV1, which is one of my more premium guns, almost for the price of the Mark I Eco. Now, don't get me wrong, they're both really good spray guns. But the MV1 comes with the rebuild kit and it sprays clear coat a little bit better than the Mark I Eco. So, oh, excuse me, it's hot out here. So go ahead, email me, 24 hour flash sale guys. 24 hour flash sale, you only got 24 hours to order. It can't come Tuesday, it can't come Wednesday. It's gonna be a 24 hour sale only. All right, so there you go. Those of you guys are tuned in. That's the 24 hour sale. Tune in, uh, get your get your MV1 spray gun. Um, like I said guys, I offer the best uh, most most professional spray guns for the price. You're not gonna find a better spray gun for a lower price. It's just simply you're not gonna find it. Those of you guys that don't know what the MV1 is, go back to my older videos. Um, click the, the 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 video new spray guns. You'll be able to see the MV1. You'll be able to see the Mark One Eco. You'll be able to see the uh, the Mark One Refresh Pro kit. But the, the 24 hour flash sale is just for the MV1. So if you guys have an air compressor set up you, and you're looking to upgrade to a really nice professional spray gun with a rebuild kit, buy it. It is the best gun you will get for $199. Yes, so those of you guys are going to ask, it's the MV1. Is it a the Vilbus DV1 knockoff? Yes, it is. It is an exact replica. It is machined pretty much to exact factory spec of that gun. You're basically getting a DV1 for a third of the price. So... Yeah, uh, Scott Huber believe that is the link for the MV1 review above all. Um, I don't have I don't have a website for the MV1s. I don't have a website actually for any of my spray guns because I, it's, it's YouTube subscriber exclusive, guys. Um, I do not sp sell my spray guns to the general public. It, you have to be subscribed to my YouTube page. I have no desire to sell to the general public. Um, I just don't. Uh, I, I want to, I'm here to help you guys. Okay. I'm here to help my subscribers. Okay. There's a lot of other people I can help in the world. I'm pretty sure my videos do circulate. Do they do help other people? But as far as my spray guns dude, it's a club. Like only me and you guys get the guns. That's it. Nobody else. Um, I plan to keep, I plan to keep it that way for pretty much for eternity. So I'm not, I make, I may, <laughs> I make you guys know I make buku money doing other stuff. The spray gun thing is just a little side thing, guys. Honestly, all it really does is put gas in my tank. Uh, you, you know, maybe put a steak or two on the on the dinner table, and that's it. And I really just do it to help you guys out. So, Alush, I assume if I say something, Elijah Nicholas, 
Hello, I'm from Bakersfield, California. Hey man, move the hell out of California. There's, their, uh, their paint laws suck. Um, <laughs> I mean, California's beautiful, man, but dude, move. <laughs> you, oh my gosh. If I, if, I was, if I was doing this in California, dude, I, dude, they would, freaking Biden would literally send the FBI to raid my shop. Like, tomorrow, tomorrow, oh my God. Like, I, I would be like on the news. Freaking crazy man paints his car in a lawn and gets raided by the FBI. Like, <laughs> it, would be, it would be nuts, man. Uh, the link I included above is a channel for the video I made back in 20, okay. All right, good. Yep, okay, cool. Uh, can I use a pancake compressor on a two liter pressure? No, you cannot use a pancake compressor, or paint a car, don't try. Um, yeah, definitely, definitely don't, don't, don't do that. Yeah, uh, Nicholas, yeah, it, it, there's a lot of rules when it comes to working on your car in California. Like, like I said, bro, get out, get out. <laughs> it's it's not a not a great place to be. So, um, yeah, mobile auto body repair is good, man. It, it, it's uh, it's a little way to uh, to get to kind of skate around the rules because if you're mobile, you're not in the same spot every day. So the the EPA and the the, the OSHA people, it's almost impossible for them to catch you because you're in a different spot every day. So, you know, yeah, but not teaching you guys how to evade the government. But yeah. You're like a brick house. Do you even lift weights? Nah, man, I just started yesterday and I, I eat Pop Tarts for gains. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Yep. Uh, won't be paid by the time the discount runs out. Uh, hey, uh, Wayne from Wayne Speed Shop. Hey, so, dude, if you want, you can send me a deposit. I'll take a deposit. You can literally send me $10 to my Cash App. Uh, if you're not, some of you guys aren't going to get paid, send me 10 bucks on my Cash App. Um, I'll consider that a deposit, and then you can send me another 190 when you get paid. Uh, it has to be within, let's say, seven days. Um, you can send me another 190, and uh, you can go ahead and get the uh, get the spray gun. So, yeah. Note to self: buy more pop tarts. <laughs> I, I always make that joke to people. They're like, "Hey, bro, like, do you do you take steroids?" Blah blah blah. I'm like, "No, no, I just eat pop tarts." <laughs> Yeah, people, people, people are like, wait, what, what? Is that, is that really true? Yeah, yeah, it's true, sure, whatever. Just, just tell them whatever, they'll believe it. <laughs> and I'm just kidding, guys, I don't know. I had told that to a couple people in joke, but no. Um, follow all your skills, thank you much for your advice. Hey, man, no problem, man, it's just what I'm here for, so. But yeah, um, all right, well, I'm gonna get off here, guys. Hey, listen, don't forget the 24-hour flash sale, 199. Okay, that's 20% off, free shipping. Guys, come on, like with all this inflation, I'm practically giving these things away. 199, get the MV1 sent to your door, free shipping. 1.3, 1.4 kit, with the digital light up regulator, with air fittings, ready to spray out of the box. You will not find another deal like this, I promise you. Nobody else has a better deal on the internet than I do. So, yeah. Uh, if you do realize the clear coat you buy is tin, do you still, re no, I, I don't, I don't reduce pretty much any of the clear coats. I, I, I never add reducer to clear coats because it can fade them. You actually are weakening the binder chemicals in the paint. And I went back and forth with a couple of other YouTubers about this to say, oh, just over reduce the paint just, or just, just reduce it, just reduce it. Well, you're, you're actually weakening the binder. The binder is the glue for the paint. You're weakening the binder um in the paint okay so now the paint's not going to stick as well all right y'all y'all all wonder why mako's ba mako's base coat, clear coat paint jobs all chip off within like a year or two not all of them but some of them okay it's because they over reduce the clear coat you're taking away the binder from the paint okay once you do that it does not stick it doesn't stick and then you have all kinds of issues with delaminations like this so no i, I do not reduce the clear coats I mean, like I said, it's some sometimes I will, but it's very rare. It's a very rare uh, situation. So yeah. So yeah, uh, Wayne, don't forget to email me, bro. Uh, like I said, just shoot me a ten dollar deposit. I'll take that as a deposit. Um, you, and then you can, when you get paid, assuming this Friday, you can uh, you can finish out your purchase. So you'll owe me one ninety. Um, you'll owe me one ninety, and then we'll be good to go. So. 
But all right, guys, I got to get off here. I got to finish getting this car taped up. This car, stay tuned this Friday. This Friday at 12 noon. I'm going to try and shoot for 12. This car will be posted. It will be done. It will be sprayed today. I will have the video footage done today, but it's going to take me some time to edit it. Tune in for the video this Friday. All right? Don't miss it. Okay? Let me see. All right. All right, guys. Look, I could go all day with you guys. I got to go. I got to paint this car. Catch you guys later. Catch you guys this Friday. I might be posting another video today or mid this week with the inflatable paint booth. Um, but I, I got to go. So don't forget to sail 24 hours. You guys got till 2 p.m. tomorrow to email me to get your MV1 at 20% off, $199. Ship to your door for free. Don't forget to email me, cash2kcars at gmail.com. Get your spray gun and start getting some crazy results like me. I'll catch you guys. All right, I gotta go paint this car.